everyone. Welcome to Red Dragon Model Works. Just a quick update. I've got parts primed, as you can see. I used um, what I always use uh, when I do something like this. Very rarely do I use um, Vallejo. Don't get me wrong, I use it. But this is my primer of choice. Bit expensive, but I don't build a lot of models, so this works. I was going to try these, but I didn't want a chance it peeling on me. So I went with them. And I got a beautiful coat on that guys. Nice fine. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful coat. Got it in inside. Just a perfect, perfect coat of primer. I was going to wet sand it. I'll wait. I'll, I'll just a small with a 2000 grit, maybe even finer than that. I have some um, very fine, you know, automotive grade, you know, sanders. And I still may do it, but we'll see. And I'll show you. Look how nice that came out. There's not a run on it. Not a run on it, guys. Nowhere. I love that stuff if you spray it the right way. And I usually warm up the bottle. See, there is not a run on that anywhere. So I got that. If you can look at here, I mean, there literally isn't a run on it. I think what I'm going to do is I'll probably go out and get a couple of cans of uh, high gloss. I have some flat black. Um, give me a second. I have a few cans of this, but um, this I want somewhat of a shine to it. This, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do a couple of test sprays, see what it looks like, and possibly go with the the shine. But as you can see behind me, I got everything primed up. The inner rims, all primed, and um, she should be ready to for assembly or you know paint in a few hours. I'm gonna let that sit and cure a bit, and then in a few hours I'll go over it. But that's this stuff is great, expensive but great. I don't have any plastic coat. You know, I don't have the cranky hookup. <laughs> so I had to go with what I had. And I did not want to chance Vallejo. I just did I, I just didn't want to do it. I'm gonna have to get a couple more cans of it to shoot this. It um I went through about a half a can, a little bit over three quarters of a can. I had a little bit in one, and this one here is is almost empty. So it's gonna take about two cans to prime this, you know. So that'll be over the weekend. But that is easy to do. It's this truck that I got to get done. And I think I, 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 I can do it in two weeks. Um, so that's where I am at. I just wanted to show you guys that so far the primer's going in, you know, laying down. And I'll tell you what, you know, she laid down perfect. What I did, guys, was I put it upside down for, I don't know, an hour. Just let it sit upside down. When I shook it, I shook it upside down, you know, like this. Shook it upside down. Had it in a little warm glass of water to warm it up, you know, because being cold and all that, and then, you know. I sprayed it in my home, but I got a little spray booth, so blew everything out, so. And it sprayed beautiful. Beautiful. I also did that with this. Put it in a, you know, warm it up. Stick it in a warm glass of water. Let it sit for a while. Until this becomes the same temperature as the warm glass of water. Take it out. Of course, dry it. Shake the piss out of it. And run it through. It comes out nice, guys. I just didn't want to use it because I'm going to be taping stuff off on this. And that stuff's too unpredictable. So that's where I'm at now. I'll be doing some uh, assembly work on this tonight. Some more little painting. And I should have this done by Sunday. The truck itself. 
and ready for its final coat of paint. And the other thing I want for all you brothers here in the United States, I, you know, all of us here on this continent, I'd like to uh, to say have a happy holiday. Enjoy your families. It's time for to reflect on what we have, you know, and give thanks for it. You know, so I'd like to say, you know, you guys have a good Thanksgiving, um, a safe Thanksgiving. If you're drinking and driving, stay home, brothers. Give somebody else the keys. Um, enjoy your families, man, you know. Try not to eat too much turkey, you know, and don't argue with Uncle Bill about politics and religion. Never helps, guys. Never helps. Been there. You guys have an enjoyable holiday. This is Red Dragon saying, peace, brothers. You know, keep slinging that styrene and enjoy your turkey, man. Have a good one.